What's up YouTube? It's your boy Truck L. Welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a hot minute, but welcome back. Today I'm going to talk to you guys about Amazon Performance Score and how you determine whether you are A, B, or C carrier. Stay tuned. Drop the intro. Like I said, welcome back to the channel. My name is Trucker L. And if you're new to my channel, I've had my authority for about two years and a half now. I lease a truck from SFI. My lease should be up in about five months. I'm still unsure whether I'm gonna keep it or return it. So I'm still determined. Me and my wife, we still trying to decide what we're gonna do, okay? But as far as today's topic, I want to talk to you guys about Amazon Relay Load Board. Amazon Relay is a service that enables carriers to self-register with Amazon and search for freight on their load board. Okay, and their performance score. So the way Amazon Load Board work is they have an A, B, and C rating system. So the A carriers get access to the loads first and whatever they don't want it goes down to the B carriers and whatever the B carriers don't want it goes down to the C carriers so it's very important to try to stay a A carrier so let me give you an example of what happened to me I uh, had booked my load for the next day I was on my way home after delivering my last load and uh, my check engine light came on I took it to the shop and they said that the truck is gonna need parts and um, I won't be able to drive it until they fix it. They said it was gonna fix it in a couple of days, but it took about a week to fix. So once I got the information, when I took it to the shop, I ended up rejecting the load and I went from being an A carrier to becoming a B carrier. Now, that rejection stays for that week or whatever you did that week stays on a six week cycle. So after that, then it refreshes. So you gotta be mindful and cautious on how you booking loads and how you running with Amazon. Things happen, but that's how I went from uh, A carrier to B carrier. When you log into your Amazon Relay app, you can see a performance score. Currently, I am a B plus 97.3%. You can also see the on time, which is a 98.5%. Your acceptance, which is a 97.3%. App usage, which is 100%. And disruption free, which is 100%. And I'm going to break all those down for you. Now, when you scroll down to the bottom, my on time is a 98.5%. When you click view details, it breaks down your on-time score. How many completed legs I did for the year so far. On time to origin. Origin delays. On time to destination. And destination delays. You could also see the on-time metric tread. Now, there are 52 weeks in a year. Currently, we are on week 14. And every week breaks down on what you have done that week that impacted your score on week 15 my on time to origin was 90.9 my on time to destination was 100 week 16 they both were 100 week 17 they both were 100 week 18 my on time to origin was 87.5 my on time to destination was 100 when you scroll down it shows the origin delay reasons late to arrival I have two of those and guard check delays. I have one of those. That's what adds up to my score. Now that we have covered on time, let's take a look at acceptance score. My acceptance score is 97.3%. I did reject one load, like I told you, because my truck did break down and it had to be in the shop. So that's why I dropped my score to 97.3. The week that it did affect was week 16 which was a few weeks ago. So I still got a couple more weeks to go before that score gets back to 
a hundred percent but until then I will only have access to a B low board until the six week cycle is complete now when you reject a load this is the penalty after start time is eight time penalty zero to six hours is four times penalty six plus hours is one time penalty and the reason that I put was overbooked now let's move on to app usage you have to download the app the relay app and you have to use it when you arrive at the origin and destination when you pick up your trailers and also dropping off your trailers so that way Amazon could track what you are doing and also the GPS so that's very easy to do I never had anything below than a hundred since I've been pulling for Amazon it's always been a hundred at all time now let's move on to the next category which is disruption free now my disruption free has always been a hundred percent ever since I've been pulling for Amazon for the last eight months plus so here's my disruption free metric tread for six weeks Amazon does offer reward for carriers if you are A carrier, B carrier and the rest of the carriers now the rewards for A carrier are load board early access short term contracts early access promotion and value added services when you scroll down to the B carriers they have everything except they do not have access to load board early access but they have everything else now for the rest of the carriers they only have access to promotions and value added services they do not have access to load board early access short term contracts early access I hope you guys enjoy this information don't forget to subscribe to the channel don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and uh, set your bell notification and I will catch you guys on the next one night peace